We've seen two of these this week. We'll see another one. Now then. Oh, that third Six dart does eight. make a difference. And how if it's not found a treble there, Sherrod would have been looking at six darts from 106 might only need three in any case tops fantastic what a leg that was it opened with a maximum and it ended with a three figure out real good leg up to them from fallon sherrick she'd left herself on 80 after 12 darts 13. Ten to require but let's give some credit here to ted evitz because he's left himself on double eight after 12 darts it's been a superb leg against the throw brilliant 13 dart leg from ted evitz that really was super ten Evans knows if he messes this up, then Fallon Sherrick should get a dart, although she'd made a mess of 80 before, should get a dart to win the set. Two 16s for Evans. This time he makes the mistake. To 20s for Fallon. Single 20. Top spin. Fallon tops for the set. And she gets it. Fallon Sherrett all square with Ted Evans. No mistake this time on the 80. Sherrett averaging 96 here. But pride when I'm watching Makuru and Sherrick and when I watched Lisa and Anna last year. They they deserve their spot. It's so increasingly frustrating when you do wow. hear the increase, you know, the minority. And it is a minority. And these girls have gone up and they are proving why they, they deserve to be there. Well at the moment you're watching two of the highest three average in this championship. Double ten. Good Goodness me. Ted Evans is in trouble here because there's no sign of Sherrick stopping. Layup any closer than 148. And so the breathing space is still there for Ted Evans. And that doesn't really turn the tourniquet and apply the pressure. And Evans holds on. The set that featured four breaks of throw. Will it have a similar fate in a last set shootout? It will if Sherrick's got anything to do with it. She wants to switch here for treble 19 or treble 15 will do just as well to lead 36. Well, it would be a great way to win a match. And I don't think too many inside the Alexandra Palace are hoping Ted Evans hits this. And he won't hit it. But they will be hoping that Fallon Sherrick can find double 18. 35. So, double 18 to keep this match alive. And she gets it in force at a side Double five. 17. Follow me, require 31. Double 14 is the pick. <laughs> well, double seven it ended up at. Double 16 with Evitz nowhere in sight. He's just got to hit another treble and hope for the best, and he's done that all right. But three darts here to put Fallon Sherrick to the brink of history. Fallon Sherrick is one leg away from making darting history at the Alexandra Palace. It's the match, Fallon Sherrick is one dart away from the second round of the World Championship. All he's got is a 60 bullseye. All he's got is a bullseye. So we're on the end of history. 36 left for Fallon Sherrick. Sherrick smashes the glass ceiling and wins at the World Darts Championship. The first woman to beat a man at the World Darts Championship. Fallon Sherrick is that woman on the 17th of December 2019. She defeats Ted Evans to write her name into the history books.